welcome. Happy Thursday, everybody. I was going to say Whiskey Wednesday, but yeah. on the day late. No, not <laughs> just Wednesday like, tomorrow. Just like you, mate. <laughs> tomorrow is the weekend, basically. Oh, I've forgotten my step. I'm not going to like Now they know your secret. <laughs> <laughs> Jackson was on camera yesterday. That's why. Yeah, Jackson is uh, a little bit, a little bit taller. But I'm actually really, really excited for today's tasting. (laughs) Because we are tasting. Oh my God, the Callan Era. It's a very cool bottle. It is a cool bottle. It is a cool bottle. We weren't privileged to it in the UK. No, exactly. I was going to say we weren't privileged to this bottle. Yeah. This was um, exclusively bottled for Taiwan. So, upcoming emerging whiskey market. Absolutely. It's actually quite fascinating to read um, the numbers. Uh, we get a monthly uh, ma- whiskey magazine. and Do we? I think I used to. And then yeah, yeah, I, I nicked it. My subscription stopped arriving on my desk. <laughs> <laughs> Did that you feel, Alex? It could have been me. Oh, but yeah. it was actually really interesting because this month they talked about Taiwan as a whiskey Wasn't market. There? I'll I'll give you the rundown of just the one article. Um, So according to the article, Taiwan is a population of about 21 million people. And I'm willing to give something away. Obviously, you guys got Google, so you're going to have to do it quick. But um, what position would you have thought in terms of value that that would come in in terms of the Scotch leaderboard? Um, in the world, so you remember, you've got the likes of China, say, so America. I would say, so, chi- so China is big, America and France. Mm-hmm. I think of yeah, the, France in was my... big, but Germany. Mm-hmm. You've got Japan. You've got loads oh, of sure. countries, and you know, twenty million people. What what it's would probably, you think? Yeah. It's, it shouldn't be so big, right? It's kind of like a trick question. I was going to say, where do where do they come? Where does Taiwan come in? <laughs> so what's really crazy is that in terms of volume. As in the amount of whiskey consumed in Taiwan, yep. they're twentieth. But in terms of value, they're fourth. You're wow. joking! Wow! So that is like just that. crazy, right? For that, you can't even imagine what type of whiskeys they're drinking over there in Taiwan. But I want to go to a party. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so let's oh. see what what we have. Okay, office trip to Taiwan. Absolutely, <laughs> RGW takes Taiwan. <laughs> Love it. I'm done. Um, wait, what are we doing today? Can we just have a rundown? Of, the of course, we can. Yes. So we are excitingly going to try this Macallan Era, which you will be able to win if you shoot oh, so nice. fancy. Um, and we are going to announce the winner of the Ben Romac. Um, as well as we I didn't get to try, I wasn't on yesterday's taste. Yeah, no, so no. Tough I luck, watch that's it. No, no <laughs> chat's <laughs> over. Should have joined the live. <laughs> um, and we are also going to Ooh, have a little blend play, game. Yay, guess, guess the distillery, guess again? the distillery, okay. exactly. Guess the guess what page in the whiskey magazine Alex is on. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm, I'm what, what page I'm on to. It's actually, it was really interesting. That it's a great read, just by the way. Yeah. What's the actual name? When is it I used to the get the magazine. Um, I actually don't really know. Oh. <laughs> when I yeah, used to, when magazine. I used to get the magazine, before <laughs> yeah. it was stolen. Um, no, it's a very good magazine actually. Yeah. Really. Uh, also, it's um, interesting. in terms of investment, um, for people who are collecting, a lot of times we find that a bottle which, not all the time, but a lot of the time, a bottle which is specific to one market suddenly goes crazy in other markets if you can't get it yeah, so yeah. it's kind of like that gray market sort mm-hmm. of situation so we found that recently when you've got uk specific releases you've got the entire world just yeah. looking at the uk and trying to snap up these bottles so yeah it's always cool also to try something which is yeah. not meant for the market also like like i think that's wider than the other mccallum it feels like it's different to the Macallan bottles that you get in the mm. UK, no? And if I, my memory serves me correctly, although I might just be completely making this up, mm-hmm. weren't there two different versions? Because one, didn't they have different boxes? There, there, was, point, two there was, like, boxes. was two different there boxes. boxes. There was two different boxes. It's, well. a, it's very t- kind of tactile, this bottle, because it's actually, it's easy to hold in your hand because uh, it's narrow. At the I bottom. really I really enjoy, I, I'm, I'm a bit mixed because I do like bottles where you can see the whiskey, but 
Yeah. I also really like bottles which give a little bit of a drama, and that definitely gives drama. It's definitely drama there. Yeah. It's very mass. It's a bit like Darth Vader. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's very classy looking <laughs> bottle. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it also it <laughs> looks like it looks like a man in a suit. Do you know what I mean? Look, like look at it on the screen. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. Right. Yeah. That could be like the collar. Uh huh. You know. Very classy looking book. Yeah, oh. No. Okay. <sighs> Ready? Oh, that was it. Oh. oh. Boom. Love that. So let's let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's exactly. see what's going on. Oh, cool colour. There you go. There we go. So yeah. Mandy says bottle looks cool. I love the black and silver. Right. It looks. You have to sometimes ask cool. yourself: Are they ever? Are they going for the women? Because we we are a bit of a sucker for a fancy bottle. In, in many ways, more so than men, I think. Um, I don't know. I, in my in my opinion, when I've spoken to a lot of whiskey collectors, yeah. and a, one of the big draws of having a nice collection is that they get a big man cave sort of situation yeah. where they have a whole shelf and I they think. display. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. They display mm -hmm. all their whiskey. Yeah. We have to remember whiskey is a luxury industry. Mm -hmm. People are only in it because they just enjoy it. Mm -hmm. And part of that enjoyment is to A, show off to your friends and B, to, to have a look and admire it. Yeah. yeah. It's a very nice colour. It is a nice colour. It's a very toffee colour. Yeah. Yeah, it's less it's less like sherry. It's not sherry. What you it's more it's almost got like a pinky tinge, like you would expect if you were like um some because, kind of wine cask. Yeah, because I, I think it, it was in sherry oak, though, so I was yeah. expecting a, a darker colour. But It does smell very sherry. Wow, though. it I does smell <laughs> very sherry. <laughs> <I'm> said that. <laughs> I'm getting more like, um, you know, honey, honey-like. Literally, smells. I was just going to say honey. Honeycomb. Mm. Honey. Caramel. Mm. Mm. I was actually tragic. speaking to someone recently, and they, they basically said that the Macallan era is their favourite Macallan. Really? So I'm actually really excited yeah. to try it. Forty percent. It's really it's odd because I would have sworn that it's higher ABV than forty percent mm. because I got a certain amount of alcohol burn up my nose. Ooh, maybe wow. it's just me. No, I, I know what you mean. I've I've had like the Glen the Glen Tower oh, which yeah, is yeah. the forty percent, mm -hmm. and that doesn't. Um, give as much on the nose either. Oh, it smells like donuts. <laughs> <laughs> My kind of whiskey. Slange. Slange. Tana, you're right, it is Zara. <laughs> Hello. Oh wow! It's That's... quite sweet. It's got quite a short finish though. I was kind of like the seemed like. Ooh. Mm. It started off <laughs> really well. That, that's my review. <laughs> <laughs> it's my other intelligent is. reviews <laughs> <laughs> because it kind of like it had a big build up. There's a lovely nose. Mm -hmm. It's quite a big flavour as it as you put it in your mouth and on the palate, and then you. I am getting a, a little bit, bit of spice sorry, though. Where's it <laughs> I'm getting a little bit of spice in the back, bit. but, but it's not what you is, want. There's a bit of a finish, but nothing like the Not big, what you expect the from a mechanic. Mm -hmm. No, I don't know, but just nothing like the initial take the palette implies that you're probably going to get. Mm. Mm. It's lovely though. We do have to also remember oh, it's so not age stated. Mm. So we don't know what's been included in the bottling. A lot of fudge apples. Mm, very mm. nice. It's mm. a worthy, worthy giveaway. Oh, it's, I like it a lot. Um, uh, you got. I was going to say I take that completely back because now this time around I got much more finished. I'm not quite sure what happened <laughs> first. It's now See? gone. <laughs> 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 that that, that quickly pattern that was great. <laughs> I'm going to have to cut that out with a clip later. <laughs> and just it's put like, it on repeat. Follow up. <laughs> I love this. This is, I know you and you and your, you know, thing over the finish, mm. but this is, might be one of my favourites we've tried. I actually think that is 
delicious. It's a lot of like fruit and it's sweet. It tastes it like gingerbread. Yes. It's very nice. So this this one, because it's not a, a bottle which you can get mm. locally, the the values will will vary hugely. Yeah. So you can be picking this up for 150, 170 pounds. Yeah. But you can also be picking up for two two fifty. Right. So yeah. depending yeah. on yeah, because they don't come through the usual distribution yeah, exactly. for the UK. Yeah. Indeed. So it's a it's yeah. a very interesting bottle. Uh -huh. It's definitely gonna look great on your shelf. Yeah. So get in like and do the other things that you're meant to do. Mm. And Tanner said something very interesting. He said, it's nice to see a bottle of McAllen open and being drunk for a change. And I think actually that's what this whole giveaway yes. series is so all about. Because when, when we, we do give it away, it's, you get the remainder of the bottle. You get the remainder absolutely. of the bottle and you get to try stuff instead of just collect them on yeah. your shelf sometimes. Yeah, it's absolutely. And I, think, I yeah. think that is a very strong issue with McAllen is that a lot of the people now are buying McAllen product and just sticking them away mm -hmm. so they're never getting drunk they're never being enjoyed so it's kind of losing that a little bit from what whiskey was always meant to be mm -hmm. exactly and I, I also worry that you know spring bank is going that direction you've got a lot of people getting in on the bandwagon so I agree with you to a certain degree but I do think that with spring bank many more people do drink it mm. so it, it whilst yes there's a big whoosh as soon as it comes out everybody rushes to get it there are a lot of people that are drinking who are, by, who are, are joining the whoosh because so, otherwise they yeah. won't get bottled is that a whoosh a a whoosh. <laughs> and what would be a typical <laughs> you know my what was the film where that thing goes <laughs> clanking oh charlie and chocolate factory when he makes the, the gob stuff or the everlasting sweet do you have a question for that brother i'll let that go till next save it for another video <laughs> <laughs> oh there's more to come it's really good whiskey <laughs> Okay, right, should so. we announce the winner of the, oh, the ben, Romack. ben Romack from yesterday? Indeed. I, I think, think we should. Good. So, yeah. the lucky winner, that's the comment, whatever it's called, comment picker. Woo! Oh, oh, Mandy Thompson. Thompson. Oh, Mandy Thompson's online. Oh, good. Amazing. Oh, and Jackson's got the Isn't technical skills. Yay. <laughs> Give it another flash, Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. So good for you, Mandy Woo! Thompson. Woo! You're showing off now. <laughs> <laughs> Mandy Thompson, congrats. That's yes. so exciting. Indeed. You run the Ben Romack, which we tasted yesterday. Yes. Uh, to win this McCallan, a very special Thursday giveaway, mm -hmm. um, all you have to do is like this video, uh, follow our page, tag some friends who you think would enjoy this too. And if you'd like a bonus entry, Share it to your story or your feed. Absolutely. Or both. Or yep. all. Indeed. So do that. Have yourselves. Or, or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yes. What we got going on at the weekend, Alves? In terms of what am I doing personally or what are we doing collectively? <laughs> oh, Alex I completely forgot. <laughs> Yeah. We, we do have a very exciting tasting coming we up do, Sunday don't we? Yes. I kind of went. <laughs> <laughs> I thought something was going on, and then there was actually something going on. So Halloween tasting, yeah, Halloween treat tasting. or treat, yes, treat, treat or treat, treat. yes. Treat treat. We're, we're looking forward to that. A yeah. really good whiskey company. It's a good if one. you are on it, then we will look forward to seeing you. Then, if you're not, why the heck not? Why? <laughs> it's just nineteen ninety nine a month, guys. Mm -hmm. um, good. So. However you get to that will probably be somewhere in the links or whatever. Alex is like, no, okay, I'll stop talking. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that's all from us, guys. Get sharing. We're going to draw the winner of this view link on Monday. So like, comment, share. Do your best, peoples. Good luck. Thanks See ya. For watching. Bye.